Welcome to a new feature release by us at Zentla. So now we have bulk actions. So bulk actions to manage users in bulk in courses, funnels or live classes, webinars. So earlier it was a big pain to manage a number of users in one go. There was no way to bulk unenroll students from courses, no way to unsubscribe leads in bulk from funnels, there was no way to unregister users in bulk from live classes, live webinars, and no way to bulk delete, remove tags. So now we have addressed this really big pain point for you. So I'm gonna go through some of the features that you can do with this now. So you can bulk, bulk unenroll students in courses. You can bulk enroll students from courses. So you can bulk subscribe leads to a funnel, bulk unsubscribe leads from a funnel. You can bulk register students to live classes, bulk unregister students from live classes, bulk register students from live webinars, and bulk unregister student from live webinars, bulk add tags, and bulk remove tags. So this is a major release from us. It allows you a real easy way of managing your students. One big point I'd like to mention to you is when you but when you bulk unenroll subscribed users from a course, it will not take away their subscription plan, okay? This is really important to know. So it does for Stripe, but it does not for PayPal and Razorpay. So it'll be up to you to contact students and tell them to actually cancel that if they've got payment plans or they've got subscriptions. This is really important for you to understand um, because obviously that's an important aspect. But other than that, you can now use these bulk actions uh, freely within Zenlight itself. So I'm gonna jump into the platform now and I'm just gonna quickly show you a few of the bulk unenroll actions that you can do with Zenla. Okay, so you can see in this course here, I have 30 enrollments in this course. What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna bulk unenroll all 30 of them from this course. So we're gonna go into here and the first thing I'm gonna do is filter. So we're gonna go into advanced filtering and I'm gonna filter for that course. So this is the course that I'm going for. So I'm gonna go enroll in course and I'm gonna go and select my course. So I'm gonna scroll down here until I find the YouTube challenge. Now I've found it, I'm gonna apply the filter. It will give me 30 results as I've got 30 people in that course. Okay, so now you can see it's page one, page two. Now we have a really good feature going on here. Once we select these like this, you're gonna see that you have a new feature that's come up here that allows you to select all 30 users, even if they're on another page. So this is another little plus point we've we've added into the bulk cunning roll. So if I clicked select all 30 users, what you're gonna get now is they will be selected on the other pages as well. So you can see that um, that selection is really handy there. So now I'm gonna bulk unenroll them from a course. So let's go to bulk actions. Let's go unenroll from a course. And let's go and select the course that these users are in. And uh, as we know, they are in this YouTube challenge down here. And we're just gonna simply click unenroll. And it's gonna say, do you sure you wanna um, unenroll these users from the course? Students will lose access to the course. We're gonna click yes. And now what's gonna happen is we have now uninscribed, unsubscribed the users or sort of unenrolled the users from the course. If I refresh this page now, you're gonna see that this becomes zero in here. As it refreshes, you will see it. And there you go, zero users. So we've taken them away from that course. Now, as I said before, be careful if you've got a subscription running or you've got a payment plan, they will lose access to that, but the payment plan will still carry on. The only exception is Stripe, where any subscriptions will be cancelled, okay? So it's important to know. Right, now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to select a random number. Let's just select uh, these ones here. There's 15 in there, and let's just go to the next page here and select these ones here. And let's go to another page and select these here. Now I'm gonna, I'm gonna enroll them in the course. So I've selected all this, I'm gonna go to bulk actions, we're gonna go enroll in course. I'm gonna go and select the course that I wanna enroll them in. And we're gonna go to there, to there, and I'm gonna click enroll. And you're gonna proceed, contacts in your selection list will not have a student role, a student role will be added. So we're gonna click this and it'll add a student role if they are leads, okay? 
So there we go, let's add the student to the beginning there. And now if we go into here and we refresh, you're gonna see that our students have been added back to the Zenla YouTube channel. As you can see, 45 have been added. So we have a lot of actions, they all work in the same way. Um, you can use the filtering here to filter out. And of course, if you select here and you select all, it will actually select all the people in your site. If I go through, you're gonna see they're all selected now, beautifully. And we can apply all these actions. So you can do the enroll, unenroll, subscribe to a funnel, unsubscribe to a funnel, register in a live, unregister from a live, register in a live interactive webinar, unregister and register in live, unregister, add tags and remove tags. So I can add a tag to all of these if I wanted to. I'm gonna do it to every single one. I'm gonna, first of all, remove this tag in here and we're gonna go in here and I'm gonna do a test one, just to add a tag, just to show you how the tag feature can work, uh, which is really handy. Let's go add. And now you're gonna see that all of my users now have got this new tag in here. And of course you can remove all the tags as well if you want to. So you can go in through here, um, select all the users, go to bulk action. Again, they're all working exactly the same way. And we're gonna remove the tags. So I'm gonna go through here, and we're gonna remove all these tags. Uh, let's just remove that test one that I just created um, down here. Let's do test one. Let's remove this tag, remove. And now that test one will be removed from all the students. So it's really easy, intuitive to work with. Again, filters work inside here as well. And you've got this new button where you can select all the users and of course all these bulk actions that you can now apply. So really easy, really intuitive to work with. You know we at Zen like to make things really easy for you guys to work with your students and manage the um, subscriptions and of course now bulk actions add to that. So this is a new feature released by us at Zenla.